Hello everybody, welcome back to the channel. So I promised you a bit of a bit kick, right? So here's a video. Just watch. So right now I'm going to start with my dry ingredients, putting my flour, my cocoa powder, my baking powder and sieve everything in this bowl. So I'll be doing that right now. Okay, so I'm done with the dry ingredients now I'm gonna face the wet ingredients so I'm putting in my eggs and look at the eggshells there so I have to be very careful not to add in the eggshells that's it so I'll mix my eggs with... so don't forget to check the description box every measurement is detailed right there don't forget to check the description box and if you have any question I'll gladly answer and don't forget to subscribe like and share this video don't forget to also comment how you like watching tutorial videos on this channel. Thank you. So I just added my oil and my butter and I'm mixing very well. So you can see that the mixture is now fine, very fine. So my sugar goes in right now and I'll keep on mixing. So this um, recipe can also go without a cake mixer. You can just use your spatula or your egg whisk and just mix your cake if you don't have a cake mixer. Very okay. So I'm adding in my buttermilk. Uh, my last video I talked about buttermilk is just a cup of milk with one tablespoon of vinegar. That is your buttermilk. So I'll mix in my buttermilk very well, very well, very well. <laughs> So I'm actually checking if there's still sugar in the mixture and you can see it's smooth. So I'm adding in my dry ingredients which are my flour, my cocoa powder, my salt and my baking soda. So everything goes in at once then I will mix. So right now I'm putting in my vanilla flavor into this uh, cake butter. Then my red food color, it's in a powder form, not in a liquid form. So the measurement for the powder form will be in the description box. So right now I'm going to mix everything, make sure everything is combined very well. You can see we have a very nice cake batter here. So I just added a tablespoon of vinegar. So this is my vinegar. Yeah, you can get that in a cake shop or any products that you want to use. So far it's a vinegar. So I'll be lining my cake pans. It's a size six, four inches high cake pan. So my oven is already heated. So I have to be fast now to put my cake batter in it. So I use um, vegetable oil and flour to line my pan in order for the cake to come out easily, no stress. Just look at how beautiful, look at how glows this cake is, oh my god. So I just love the texture of this cake butter. This is how red velvet butter is supposed to be. Mm? So yummy, so glossy, so fluffy not thick just okay our cake is ready so this lovely cake i'm just someone must try it so if you have not subscribed please subscribe for more videos <laughs> 